Hi all. Welcome to Edumos Infotainment. Today we are going to learn some easy ways to solve problems related to some of faces of rolling dice. First, let's start with the case in which two dice are thrown or a case in which a dice is thrown twice. In both the situations, we will follow the same method. Shown here is a table indicating the probabilities of rolling two dice simultaneously or one dice being rolled twice. The easiest way to do problems is to remember this table and this table is really easy to remember. In this table we can see that the probability increases from 1 by 12 to 6 by 12 and then decreases back to 1 by 12. Now we will move to the case where three dice are thrown simultaneously or one dice being thrown thrice. In this case, it is not at all easy to count all the cases. So here we give a formula to find the total number of cases. In this formula, R denotes the sum of faces you want to find. If the sum of faces ranges from r is equal to 3 to r is equal to 8, the number of favorable cases is given by r minus 2 into r minus 1 divided by 2. If the sum of faces ranges from r is equal to 13 to r is equal to 18, the number of favorable cases is given by 19 minus r into 20 minus r divided by 2. If the sum of the faces is either 9 or 12, the number of favorable cases is 25. If the sum of faces is either 10 or 11, the number of favorable cases is 27. Hope this video was helpful. Thank you for watching.